In today's video, me and my friend are going to do the spicy noodle challenge! <laughs> hey guys, what's up? Welcome to another video from Ling Ling. Today I am with my beautiful friend Secret from Singapore. Hello! Hello. <laughs> and I asked her if she was up for doing the spicy ramen challenge, but it's a China edition. So uh, what does that mean? That means we're having like the Chinese type of Spicy, spicy noodles. noodles instead of the Korean ones. Yeah. yeah. So it's not ramen ramen. Mm, it's like, like spicy noodles. Chinese noodles. Yeah. I asked my friend who is from a spicy province to help me find the spiciest ones here in Beijing. Beijing people don't really eat spicy, so we hope that this is still spicy. It did say very spicy on the package. It's <laughs> <laughs> gonna show you guys. It's not like super red, but we do have some red sauce around it but there is a lot of chili in here and I was also very excited when I realized that there's a lot of coriander in here and too. Coriander. I hate it. I hate, hate, hate it. I love coriander. It's disgusting. Like last time down in the kitchen, I smelled it when I walked in there. I was like, I can't cook today. Oh. Somebody <laughs> has been playing with coriander in here. I'm done. <laughs> Literally, I was just like. <laughs> Can you tell me a little bit about your uh, spicy uh, spicy eating habits? I don't really take spicy food, no. although I'm Asian because a lot of people think that like Asian people yeah. eat like they take a lot of spicy food, I but so like. Too. No, no. I'm from Singapore, but in, like, my parents, they take a lot of spicy food, but yeah. I don't. I've been in Australia for too long, I guess. Yeah, <laughs> well, when I was in Australia, it's too, it's like no spicy food no, at all. No, no, no. no. Oh, well, I love curry. I love Japanese curry because they're like sweet. Yeah, yeah, yeah they're me sweeter, too. Yeah. but like not used to tight. Like, yeah, curry. no, I know. That's the same for me. Like, I'd never had real spicy food before I came to China. Yeah. So when I was in Dongguan, it's more of like a sweeter area in China. Every province has like different spices. Yeah. 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 So uh, yeah. Guangdong is quite sweet. But when after Guangdong, I actually went up to Sichuan. Sichuan is like, oh, everything is spicy. Every single yeah. dish. Seriously, spicy. like I said, bu yao la. I don't want spicy, but it was still spicy. Yeah. Like, yeah. I, I didn't eat anything for a week. Yeah, so that's my um, spicy eating experience. Mm -hmm. Like, I think I can take a little bit more than before, but still, mm -hmm, not much. Mm -hmm. No, I'm such a poo. See, yeah. <laughs> we will see. So we got our chopsticks here. Let's get started. I got a glass of milk as well <laughs> to save my ass. <laughs> okay, are okay. you ready? So yeah. we finished this. Yeah, it smells good actually. No. <laughs> no, I don't just think like, so. <laughs> I think it's like, oh, uh, yeah, no, already I'm just like, I see it's red, coriander, it's just the. Uh, I can smell chili already. Yeah, it's slowly coming. It's like in the beginning, it was like, oh, it's not that bad. Mm. But then it's slowly coming. Yeah. It's like the aftertaste, I feel like. Mm. Oh, yeah. Right? Yeah, at the back mm. of my tongue. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> I feel like if I just swallowed the whole thing, it would be fine. Okay, it's coming now. It's coming now. It's coming now for me. <laughs> the chili. I think it's good that we didn't do the Korean ones. <laughs> that would I think we were like die. We would be dead now. I've been like, I've been having nightmares about this challenge. So. <laughs> I'm gonna take the chili. Yeah. Yeah. Mm -hmm. How long? Gonna do it. Yeah. <laughs> Okay, I don't, I don't get it. I don't get why people like it. Like, guys, if you like spicy food, please let me know in the comments below Ooh. why. Whew, because I have a lot of friends. Yeah, I have a lot of I like, have so many friends. Yeah. Like, from all of the world, all over the world who like spicy food. And I just don't get it. Like, they see, I guess, spicy hot pot from Sichuan. They're like, oh my god, it's so delicious. More spicy, the better. I'm just like, are you freaking kidding mm -hmm. me? Yeah, then they like, like to add like chili. They bring their own chili around. I mm, know. <laughs> Mm. <laughs> okay, it's burning good on my tongue now. Like my tongue is burning. It's on fire. It's getting a bit warm in here. <laughs> I know. <laughs> You're wearing this sweater. I'm gonna like. Uh, uh. <laughs> mm. <laughs> mm. 
I can't even, <clears throat> when we saw the other challenge, I felt like they really grabbed like the whole thing and just like, ah, rah, rah. yeah. But it's really hard. Oh, it's coming. Oh, it's just like skirting down my throat now. Oh, it's getting warm now. <laughs> it's just like, it's a treat. You just have to like finish it really quickly. Mm. So like, <clears throat> like it doesn't stay in your mouth. I feel like this ball is never getting like more empty. Like it's, it's still full. It's like, better than me. It literally looks the same as when we started. <laughs> like I was actually really excited for this challenge because I didn't I didn't eat lunch. <laughs> I saved my tummy for this. <laughs> and I was like, ah, oh, burning. <sighs> yeah, and we got more, so you can eat the rest. <laughs> <laughs> so uh, maybe we should tell them how I I, I screwed up the the cooking part. Oh my god. <laughs> I have a so, boiler here. I thought it was boiling my food. It wasn't a boiler. It was a rice cooker. <laughs> so I didn't she <laughs> cooked like noodles in the rice cooker. <laughs> <laughs> it was so weird. And, and I was like, it's just a boiling pot, whatever. No. <laughs> and she kept saying, no, it's for rice. It's for, for rice. rice. <laughs> it's, it's legit. It's a rice cooker. <laughs> I got it from Thailand from my friend. Like she brought it here. Her maid put it in her um, suitcase. So she didn't really know what was in her suitcase. She, she'd never been like cooking for real before. Mm -hmm. So she kind of just like left it here in our place, in our room. So I just started using it. Now I boil everything in it. Like everything, all my like vegetables, eggs, and like... vegetables, pasta, <laughs> even chicken. Like sometimes I don't want to go to the kitchen. I just boil the chicken. It's really sad actually. Well, I guess you can do it, but like mm. it's just weird because <laughs> it's a rice cooker. <laughs> oh my god. But yo, you want to know something really weird? Like, <laughs> when I was studying in Australia, <laughs> do you know like the, the kettle mm. you use to boil water? <laughs> I put like instant noodles inside the kettle. Inside? How and, I turned, and I turned it on because I was so lazy to walk to the kitchen. Oh my god. <laughs> and I was just like, I was oh thinking, my god, I thought I was so smart. I was like, I could just cook my noodles inside the kettle. <laughs> so I pour How everything, put go? everything. It was really like, uh, it was just really soggy. <laughs> <laughs> I thought it would burn in there actually. No, it was really, really soggy. And then, like three days later, when I wanted to boil water, I was pouring water out, and it's like there's like few noodles stuck in there. <laughs> it was a complete fail. Oh. <laughs> don't do that, guys. I don't do that. Okay, guys. just saying, don't do it. <laughs> and try not to cook noodles in a rice cooker too. <laughs> yeah, yeah, just don't do it. Unless you don't have other choices, obviously. But I just feel like this one doesn't look like an, an like an actual rice cooker, like the ones I've seen before. <laughs> This one, this one looks more, for me it looks like just a pot you can boil stuff in, but what do I know about rice cookers anyways? I didn't know that was a thing before I came to China. I was like, what? Seriously? Like you have a separate thing for mm -hmm. rice? Like, come on, what? <laughs> really convenient. Mm. Rice, water, and then bam, mm. rice. And they can, they kind of take care of themselves. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah, because yeah, that's my problem. Like I always want to eat, I always want to eat um, pasta. But I cook my food because I only have one boiler. So pasta is usually the last one on the list. <clears throat> wow, I feel like when I talk, the burning is just mm. like, every time the air is kind of like pushing the yeah. burning. Ugh. Yeah, so I never get to actually cooking the pasta because at that time I'm already, I, I, I don't cook before I'm starving. Mm -hmm. <laughs> so, because I have to force myself. <laughs> so I kind of like, I eat it. I eat the food on the go. Like while I'm cooking, I also eat it. So I cook an egg and then I'll start eating that while I cook the chicken. What? And then I'll eat some of the chicken while I boil my uh, my broccoli. Are you sure that like, the chicken and everything is cooked before you <laughs> start eating it? Uh, well, uh, I guess. Uh, <laughs> maybe that's why I always have a stomach ache. <laughs> yeah. Mm. I gotta say, in this one, um, the coriander is not that like. Yeah. You can't really taste it. Yeah. And I'm very happy about that. I would never eat this like voluntarily though. <clears throat> it's not for me. Like the taste is so off for me. So off. Uh, anyway, we did a good job. Like. Ooh, yeah. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Ooh, whoa. Yeah. <laughs> 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 oh. And mushroom. No marshmallows. Marshmallows. <laughs> Apple marshmallow. Mmm. Yeah. That's good. Mm. Spicy food. 
Will you do it again? No. <laughs> I'm not gonna I'm not gonna do a spicy ramen challenge like a ramen ramen. No. No. This was like <clears throat> this is already close to my limit. Yeah. Like just if I'm happy that we're not laying on the floor rolling around in our own sweat. Yeah, yeah. I'm I'm pretty happy about that. I hope you guys are happy too. Mm -hmm. Please say yes. <laughs> yeah. I can see really my tongue. I know. <laughs> Me too. It's like mm -hmm. da, 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 da. <laughs> Mm. You want to rest? Drink a little more. <laughs> One more marshmallow. No, that was all from Lingling and Secret here in Beijing. <laughs> <laughs> Thank you guys for watching. If you like these kind of challenges, China edition challenges, please let me know in the comments below because I would love to do more. Like it's very fun. It's, yeah. it's different, you know. I've shared a lot about experience in China, China experience in general, but I thought it could be cool to kind of twist it, to, you know, and spice it up a little bit. Not this spicy, yeah. but maybe just a little spice, you know? <laughs> yeah, so uh, let us know uh, what you think in the comments below. Give us a thumbs up for this video, for our... our Rose. Yeah, spicy, our, <laughs> for our, mm, what is that called? Um, <laughs> for our Nuli. Nuli. That's what I was thinking. And courage. Yeah. Yes. Yongan. Yes. Yongan. What? <laughs> okay, we should stop talking now. <laughs> Thank you for Thank joining you. and have a nice <laughs> evening wherever you guys are in the world. We will see you again very, very soon. Ling Ling and Secret is out. See ya and Bye bye.